another Mac app. This time it's called Geek Tool. This has some really great possibilities. It, I think, two. I don't actually use this, but it it's still a great app. You might like it. It's for OS ten. It says for panther or tiger, but it works with leopard too. The, the main feature seems to be that it allows you to put the contents of a text file on your desktop or a picture on your desktop and it updates in real time. So the example it, it's got is to put the system.log or console.log file on your desktop and then you can monitor the monitor OS X's activity. Now, now just I'm not going to talk about this for ages but just think of the possibilities that this opens up being able to put a, an image or, the, or a text file right on your desk on your desktop you can monitor just about anything and then you can use other tools it suggests some here to monitor other things like CPU memory bandwidth anything you want it's got some <laughs> really cool screenshots of what people have done with it. Ch check it out, Geek Tool. But like I said, I don't actually use this. I can never see my desktop anyway, I've got too many windows covering it. But it's a, it's a fantastic app for OS X. You can do some great things with it. And it's, it's extremely configurable. It's a system preferences pane that gets installed and then you can you can configure just about anything and you can put a file a shell a picture on I, I haven't even tried this yet so I can't even explain how it works it does look like a really great program though so if you use OS 10 and you're a geek check out geek tool I mean, I don't particularly want to use it. it just doesn't. It it does interest me. But just I don't really have a great use for it that I would need. I I tend to like to keep things like that on my dashboard, so they're easily accessible but out of the way. But you might like it. Geek tool. You can it's a long URL. You're better off just typing geek tool all one word into Google. It's projects.tynsoe.org forward slash en forward slash geek tool slash index.php. I don't think you need the last bit though. Yeah, just forward slash geek tool. I'll, I'll just, just Google it geek tool. One word comes up as the first result. That's how I just found it. So if you know of a, another tool for OS X or Windows or Linux, please tell me info at jackie.com, that's my email address. And jackie.com, J-A-K hyphen E is also where you'll find my blog, all my videos, the live stream, the chat and lots more. Thanks for watching.